Hello YouTube, it is Damien, it is Sunderland, it is Bright Lights, it is episode 48 of Bright Lights, it's not the FA Cup final, but we do have Arsenal today, it's the league run in, we are currently sitting 5th on goal difference with Manchester City who are qualified for the Europa Champions League apparently, is a game knowing something that we don't um, know the Europa League, there we are, that's fine, there we go, we're not, um, they drew today, wow that's huge, who did they just, they, I know they had Spurs, I think they had Chelsea, that is massive. That makes this game even bigger. They drew 4-4. What a crazy game. Let's have a look at it. Icardi there. I tell you what, they could have lost that game. They came back into it. As things stand, if we beat Arsenal, it would be all to play for on the last day of the season to finish fourth. What an interesting result. As things stand for like injuries, Haller's going to be back for this game. He's doubtful for this one. I'm not going to play him, but he is on the bench. Just in case Watmore gets injured like late doors, we'll get him on to chase the win. Got in still also doubtful. The, you know, by having a world class, um, having a world class scouting, um, yeah, sorry, fit, ment medical team, players come back from injury that slight bit quicker. So a four to five week injury turns into a two to four week injury, and it's just so good. You know, our staff is amazing. We've got the best staff in the league. Anyhow, big game against Arsenal. I wouldn't mind injuring a few of the of the players here. This Arsenal squad's amazing. You know, we do have to look at it because we do have him in the FA Cup in a couple of weeks' time. Their key hot prospects, this guy on loan, um, at Norwich. You know, Nabil Fakir is their key man. Um, you know, their captain is currently uh, Nabil Fakir as well. And Hamsik, you know, they've got such a world-class midfield. It's not beyond the joke. They're very good up top. Big game here. As you can see, two draws between the two items. One win and one win both ways. It's a very, very even fixture, this one here. Which probably bodes well that the FA Cup's going to be an even fixture too. Anyhow, Zidane Zidane's their manager. We are going to get into it. Like I said, Howard's going to play with Daniel Burgess, Diogo De Silva, Dosek. Um... Alex there, Luizano, what more because of that injury to Halo, who's been in some fine form, by the way. We actually look at his last little bit of form. He's played quite well, especially in the last game he scored. Um, there we are. He has scored an 8.9. And since the Man United game, only one game, he did beat Wolves 3-1, which um, what more had a weldy in. We are going to submit the team for this one here. We do have Luizano in the hole and obviously Marquez and Joe Silva, who's going into quite the strike and just can't bury chances. They've got Hallard, you know, the Norwegian. He's just a freak. I wanted to sign him, but he didn't want to come. Arsenal played... 27 mil for him, and you can see why. There we are. I know HBG is going to be happy with that in the chat. They got Eduardo Carrasco. Torreira's grown into a decent player, that's for sure. The 27 year old defensive midfielder. Fikir Sabitza. A Bell is a regen. The 17 year old, he doesn't look great. They must have an injury problem at right back, which is good for us. The Litz there, Kalasanac. Lopez in goals. We'll see how we go. Anyway, dressing room. I just want to tell them here. Oh, okay. We've been on a good run lately. Let's go out there. There we go. Yeah, HBG is already happy in the chat that he's seen Halan there. I set opposition instructions. Can we beat Arsenal here at Arsenal, or is it going to be a game where we lose? Win today, going in against Stoke, we would be favourites to finish in fourth place and finish in the Champions League. Don't win today. It's all to play for on the final day, like it would be anyway. But maybe we can do something anyway. Eduardo, there's a bit. So the last time we played a big team in the top four. There we are. Good luck, says Jackson for the win. Thank you. Score prediction, Jackson, for the win. Eduardo, crunching tackles. A bit near. Top of the box to Bele, the regen. Torreira! Always put it wide as the key chance. Early doors for Arsenal. And as things stand, it is nil-nil. It's not the FA Cup final just yet. But this does bode for the FA Cup final in the second. We'll play a slightly different team in the FA Cup final. Anyway, we missed the ball there. Dosek, though, does win it. Didn't realize how long were you were talking about until I saw the Arsenal team sheet. There we are. Anyway, the lit there with the ball. Alex wins it back. Dosek. Oh, that's just poor from Dosek. But Luzano wins the second ball. De Silva flicks in. Marquez, big chance. Huge chance. Marquez! Marquez! Rodrigo! What a year we're having! What a season! Second year in the Prem. Doesn't matter. We might finish in the Champions League. Rodrigo, Marquez, you know, Silva finds Marquez, sorry. After Luzano won it back. And there we are. Hitting him on the break. We're one new up against Arsenal. Who we have in the FA Cup final. Here we go. Unbelievable scenes. We're one new up. Let Bele cross. He's got bugger all crossing, doesn't he, though, um, thing. Doesn't he, the regen? We've had one shot and scored. I'll take that every day. It's not like us to do that, to be honest. We need numerous chances to score, usually. They've got an injury. Bernat's on, which I don't like. But at least Kalesin, that's out for a little bit. I think Bernat's a while better player. It looks like a poor hamstring for Burgess. We're not taking no chances. He's going to come off the line. So we have a FA Cup to think about. Marcos flicks it on there. Only as far as Bele. Bele now with the ball. He puts it down long, but only as far as Burgess is about to come off. 
and he gives it away. Halar now with the ball. The pacey hitman running with it. Still with the ball. Back to Bernard, who's just come on for the injured Kolasinac. Who finds Torreira. Luca Torreira. who's had a very good time in the Rural Life Premier League at the moment. Bele, who's the regen, who doesn't look his best. The ball out wide. Watmore doesn't win it. Carrasco now with it. Comes inside. Goes back on the outside. Carrasco with the ball. Eduardo makes it 1-1 just like that. And with that in mind, I am actually going to get Burgess off. And we are going to bring Jonathan because Linus isn't fit. I just remember that. Saras is going to have to do a job. There we are. I just don't want to risk him. I just realised Linus is injured, isn't he? We don't have Linus on the bench. We usually do. Carrasco there with the ball. I just, you know, the FA Cup means more to me. You know, we're going to finish in the Europa League as things stand anyway. So they get John out there. It's okay. Anyway, Marquez with the ball. Still with Marquez. Here's ball into Luizano. Luizano now over the top. Looking for what more? Silva! Oh, it was a key chance. See the chances he misses? See the chances he misses the wonder kid. He is growing into quite a striker. But the chances that he misses is beyond me. There we go. Half time, 1-1. One, one. Look, they deserve to be level, Arsenal. I'm going to tell them that I'm happy with the performance. Keep it up. Look, level points for Manchester City. It goes down to the final day. That's fine. But a win here. A win here knows that if we beat Stoke on the final day, which we probably will, and we'll be all right, depending on where Stoke are. Anyway, Lewis on a great touch, but Fikir with a great challenge. Not known for his tackling. Torreira into Halan. He's pacey. He's quick. He's elite. Halan won't miss. Matu now down, just like that, straight after half time. Erlan Halan makes it 2 1 Arsenal. And we've gone from being fourth spot back to fifth. And there we are. Just Luzana losing it easily. Torreira with the ball over the top. Finds Halan in between the space. And it's a great finish there from the Norwegian international. And it's 2 1 all of a sudden. Just going to tell the lads get creative, find your chance. Silver's not having the best of time. I'm going to get him off early. We've already made a chance, though. But Marcus Wood... Marcus Wood. So Marcus Torum's going to come out there, not um, Daniel Wood. And there we go. We need a chance. We have to go attacking. And there we are. We need a chance here. Late doors. We need a goal, so then we can go for it late doors. Anyway, Fikir now with the ball. Fikir's ball back post. Headed. Diogo. Oh, what a mistake. It's 3-1. It's game over. We have to go for it now. Lozano's off. You know what that means, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. It is time to bring Daniel Wood on. The uh, youth intake legend himself. And there we are. Mickey FM, how are you, mate? I'm good. How are you? <sighs> Such a shame. We're one new up in this game. We could have been sitting fourth. Instead, we're 3-1 down. We're obviously on very attacking. Three strikers. We need, a, we need to find a way. You know, the injury to Burgess has hurt us. But we have an FA Cup to think about. It's got to be 4-1, isn't it? Fakir with the ball. Headed away from Dossek. Maybe we can hit him on the break. Marquez, he'll give us a chance here. Still with Marquez. The ball there. Finds Daniel Wood. He's got numbers in the box. Daniel Wood, can he cut it? Tackled. Alex! There we go. Bit lucky. But there we are. 3-2. Is there time? Push forward. We need two goals in the last 10 minutes to go back in the fourth spot. Going into that final game. Marquez with the ball to Daniel Wood. Look, if the FA Cup final's like this, we've got an FA Cup final on our hands. Daniel Wood with the ball. His ball there, you know, it doesn't get there anyway. It's cleared into him. It falls to him. There we are. Can we find another one, maybe, late doors? Here we go. Time ticking away. Can we find one? Can we get a draw? Can we rescue something? Time's ticking away here. Doesn't look like it's coming. There's five minutes at a time. Three minutes. It's a highlight. How's your day been? F -A -F -F um, FIFA bounce goal, that one. Yeah, it is. Long ball. Marcos doesn't win. Barely there. I'll answer in a second, Mickey FM. The ball, what more? We've got numbers to rum. Give it to Daniel. Marquez back post. Marquez, it's to rum. Marquez, cut it. What have you done? Just cut it. To Silva. Ho Wesley, hoid it. Lumps it long. To rum doesn't win it. Can we get back out there? Hoid it. Long towards what more? Bernard, what more might get there? Cuts it. Marquez, free, free. We're back level points with Man City. And there we go. We'll be fifth going into the final day. But level all points with City. Unfortunately, our goal difference is fucked. So it doesn't matter. But there we go. Is there time? Have to go very attacking. Have to find a win here. Can we do it? The FA Cup final for Slight. This is going to be a weldy as well. Hashtag scenes. That is correct. Hashtag scenes. Is there enough time? Diogo to Daniel. We have to get it long. Daniel goes second lines. It's all over. Thank God. Because I thought he just gave it away. And there we go. Come back from what? 3-1 down to score two goals late doors to win it. And there we are. My day has been okay, Mickey. I pushed trolleys in 38 degree heat. We then have got one, one footsal 7-3. And now we're here. Team talk has gone well. 
on the base of it, it's another even game. That means that Arsenal has played a 1-1. We've won one, and there's been three draws when we've met each other. We've got Stoke on the final day, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Out for... Look. We have to go and give him to the physio, so then he can play the FA Cup. We're going to attend there. It's the turning point of the season um, for us, obviously, in November, when we change tactics. Um, I think there. I just subscribed to your YouTube channel. Now you're 99. Thank you, Mickey FM. You can catch up with the series on there. The whole thing's up there. Just how damaging. I'm pretty much at the tear. My notes. It was absolutely epic. That's a good plug, though, guys. As you can see here, I'm going to bring it on stream. For everybody on the YouTube watching this, follow the link below on Twitter. And also, please go and subscribe to make it number 100. There we are. Got to put that back in there. That's a very good plug. Will Burgess, unfortunately, casually made too close to the edge. I'd rather not comment on it. Um, the boys are always raring to go, but it's particularly at kickoff. We qualify for the Euro Cup, which is, you know, beyond my wildest dreams. We're predicted to finish 14th. Second year in the Prem. I was just looking to finish 10th again. And we've just lucked into it here. As things stand, we're level on points with Manchester City. On the final day, I think Man City have an easier game. They have got West Brom, who are already relegated. We ourselves have Stoke, who are playing to survive. So it's going to be a big day on the final day anyway. We are going to save the game. We are going to tell YouTube that we'll see you in just a second for the part two of episode 48 of Bright Lights. We will be playing Stoke on the final day to see if we can finish in fourth in our second year in the Premier League and get a Champions League play playoff play uh, place. Welcome back, YouTube. It is episode 48 in this part two. Um, we can share your elf songs here to you. By all means, Phil, there we are. Yeah, I feel. It's the final day. It's Stoke versus Sunderland. Um, bit of injury news. Uh, Bird has picked up a knock, um, obviously, in the last game. Watmore picked up a knock in training, but he's going to play for it. Um, next big news is we actually offered a new contract to Frank because we could offer him a new work permit. Because he's played so much for Australia recently, um, I decided to go and approach him on a work permit. He's actually got it. So now we've gone from no left-back depth to two left-back depth. I'm actually going to keep Frank around because I think he's slightly better than Wallace. Um, if we go down to the bolus, we should be able to see Wallace here. Wallace is a bit young, right? Um, Wallace is very well-rounded, but maybe um, Frank's not bad at all what he does. What I might do is I might keep Frank in here and loan out Wallace um, to a lesser side somewhere and just get him first in football and really grow. And then the year after, bring him back in and see how he goes. Because Wallace has grown into quite the player. You know, he's been doing all right as Wallace. There we go. Anyway, we're going to give Frank the start. Diogo's in here for the last time of the season. Smoothies will start the FA Cup final. Hi, there's Kim Jan, the other wonder kid here, is going to be there. I think he's got a few downward arrows in his last training, even though he's training at about a 10. Linus will start, obviously, with the injury to um, Will Burgess. Sadie Shampoo will come in for the final time this season. Miguel's going to play as Mazala. Alex is going to play in the hole. What more? We are going to actually bring... No, we're going to play these two, because it is an important game that we do need to win, and it was seven days away. One player, number two, Frank, who is one of Australia's key players. And there we go. He's got number 21. That is fine. Score predictions in the chat for the final day against Stoke away at the Britannia. Win here today and results go away. We could finish in the Champions League. As things stand, we, um, we are going to finish in the Europa League anyway. Look, I think we should be realistic and say the Europa League is probably better off for us because we're well suited to the Europa League. But if we can make the Champions League, oh boy, oh boy, I would be excited. Um, Sunderland can book a spot in the Champions League here if results go our way. Uh, we would deserve to qualify and put ourselves... If it happens, so be it. Something we spend a lot of time feeling, not thinking about in the pre-game. Haller's left out. He's not ready to start this game, but he'll be ready to start the FA Cup final. Anyhow, Stoke in the red and the white. It's us in the black. The first thing we've got to do is get it up on later scores. Can West Brom hold Man City? West Brom are dead last. Stoke are currently playing to stay up. You know, they win today, they could stay up. Anyway, time in there with the ball. Um, his ball there finds Jovetic. Um, Jovan. Anyway, Linus wins it and goes long. He looks for Joe Silva, doesn't find it. Lenahan, who I've used as a fullback on plenty of FMs in previous years, he goes into a decent one. Sergio there, and Bulo switches it out to a Tobo. And Tobo now with the ball. And Tobo swings it in back post. And Diogo there. There's a follow. There's an Alan Padre. Thank you, Phil. Get your Alan Padres out. Thank you, Phil, for the follow. Your follower number 325. Anyway, Hoyt there finds um, the Australian and Giovanni. Giovanni finds Alex. Alex now with the ball. Out towards Watford. Doesn't find him. Time him there. And Bullo heads away. Linus gets up though. The club captain. And it will be Duncan Watmore running inside. Still with Duncan. Still with Duncan. Still with Duncan. Duncan! He's hit the post. It would have been a great solo goal. And Ripley picks up the loose ball. And it's currently nil nil after two minutes. We have to go. Man City already one new up. Looks like it's going to be fifth. Barring West Brom heroics. It looks like it's going to be fifth. Anyhow. Sterling with the ball. 
throws in the Yanapai, but it will be Alex. Alex with the ball. His ball long, but it's cleared away um, only as far as Lenny Hand. Durante picks it up in this Mazzala. It was really good as a Mazzala bar. Finds Joe Silva, the youngster. Joe Silva, he finishes finally. He has a habit of finishing so missing so many one-on-ones. But he does score there, the one that kid, Joe Silva. He's been growing so much of late. And there we go. It was a poor ball from um, Lenny Hand who I have used on previous time. Miguel there, the Mazzala, he's to play well. Finds Joa Silva. Silva there, buries it. And there we go. It is currently 1-0 Sunderland. Big game, big moment. Looking away at this Man City game, which means we're going to finish tight on points in fourth. As things stand, goal difference will hurt us. That Liverpool 9-0 loss would, you know, do us in. You never know. West Brom, as long as it stays 1-0, can score late and make us and break us. Anyway, Linus throws it in to Miguel. Miguel back to Linus. Back into Miguel. Back into Linus. Here we go. Whips it in back post. Headed away only as far as um, Frank Giovanni or Giovazzo. There we are. He gets there, beats his man. It wasn't a foul, and they clear along. And it will be the Galia who holds it up and jump out there with the ball. His switch of ball out the Cabral was really good. He beats one Cabral, Jovan Cabral. Kim Jan just sits him down. The South Korean international says, that's my ball. Not a defensive mistake, though. That's a rush ball, but Alex does well. Anyway, Frank. I think we're just going to call him Frank. It's too, much, too hard of a minute. Um, a last name to pronounce. Marquez now with the ball. Still with Marquez. He clears it into Miguel. Miguel now through to Watmore. He's in goal going score for Duncan. We want more. That's Duncan want more. There we go. 36 minute. Duncan makes it two. Look, if we weren't so far behind on goal difference, we maybe could believe about maybe overturning it. I think we're like 12 goals. Man City have had a poor year, but banged in the goals. So unfortunate for us. It's 2 new up against Stoke. We're sending Stoke down. It's all about what West Brom can do against Manchester City right now. Barring if Stokes score from kickoff, of course, as they come through with a tall ball. And tall ball now with the ball. Can't win the tackle. And board on now. Ball out to Sterling. Sterling there with the ball. His ball there to Sergio. Sergio there. Finds in Bolo. In Bolo now to Sergio. Sergio there. Sterling. He cuts it to him. Bolo. In Bolo. Hits it wide, thank God. Couldn't deal with them scoring a goal just then. FA Cup final coming up. I'm so buzzing. So buzzing. That will be the next YouTube episode. Link is in the description below. Unfortunately, we will have already played the YouTube um, the game before you can see the link, YouTube, to come follow us on Twitch. Why I should have done it previously? Why I should do it now for the future? It could be the Champions League or the Europa League. We don't know just yet. As Frank brings it forward to Alex. Alex now with the ball. Still with Alex. Goes long towards Silva. Great touch. Straight out Ripley. But Silva puts it in after the rebound. with 3 nil up here and flying. Good form to be entering into the FA Cup final. And there we are, three new up in, cru in cruising. I'm um, definitely going to take a couple people off, I reckon, just to rest people so we do get, um, you know, just so we do. Anyway, there we are. He does get his foot to it and Ripley can't save it. You know, maybe like Marquez, who's a key player for us, um, and a few others as well, just see who's doing what. Anyway, the ball into a tall ball. A tall ball now with the ball in, um, still running down the right-hand side. It's a great country talent to Sergio. Sergio now with Mbolo. Mbolo now with the ball to Sergio. Still with Sergio. Out to Sterling. Is that Rahim? Maybe worth taking a look there. Anyway, headed away from Hoyer. Only as far as Mbolo. Back to Sterling. Sterling with the ball to Sergio. Still with Sterling. Sterling cuts it back post. Giovanni doesn't get up. Miguel heads away. Only as far as Watmore. Can we hit him on the break? It's a great ball to Marquez. Marquez. Joe Silva wants it at the back post. Does he get it? Silva! He should have scored to make it as hat trick. Instead, he misses. And there we are. It's only 3 0. Man City 2 0 up. We are finishing fifth. Look, I'll take fifth. What a year it's been anyway. And there we go. But we're going to end it on a high here. Half time here. Team talk. Going to tell the boys that we were excellent. I'm very pleased as things stand. There we are. Tactically, we're going to make a sub here. I'm going to get Marquez off for to run. Um, just so Marquez doesn't get injured for this FA Cup game. Anyhow, Jonah Pai with the ball there. Finds a Tobo. A Tobo with the ball. Still with a Tobo. Still with a Tobo. He crosses it in, but it's blocked. And there we are. Time ticking away. Here we go. Eight shots to on target to the 11 shots. Nine. 50 minutes played. There's other people that we can think about here. You know, um... Hmm, trying to think. Alex probably is going to play the FA Cup final. Uh, who else? You know, because he's not 100% fit. Might get Alex off here. I don't want to put in Luizano, but we will. There we are. Alex is off. 
Um, just got to think about it. Luzana's also going to play the FA Cup final, but we'll limit his game time here. Anyway, Miguel with the ball. Still with Durante Miguel. Still with Durante Miguel. He whips it out to Watmore. Duncan now with the ball. Still with Duncan. Can he whip one in? He does whip one in. Back post towards Taram. He won't win it. Sterling there with the ball. Header away. And it will be a tall ball as Stoke need four goals to save themselves from relegation. The ball there cleared away by Hoyer into Alex. Alex now brings it forward again before he comes off. Beats a challenge. Giovanni. Uh, Giovanni. Giovanni. Frank. Just Frank. Frank there with the burst. Sergi Sampri. Alex. Miguel. Back to Frank. Frank, the Australian on Dabu. Can he get an assist? Good ball in. Taram there hits the bar. Deserved it. Frank with a delightful ball in. And there we go. It is currently 63 minutes played and playing quite well. There's the change made. There we are. Highlight then the other end. Alex Gallera puts it in. And Bola with a header. Diogo can't keep it out. And unfortunately, in the final game, Diogo will play this year. He will concede the new, the appointed first choice goalkeeper here at the club. And in Bola with the goal. They need another three more stoke to get back into it. Thinking about the other changes here, the, um, Durante Miguel's had a very good game. We are going to bring him out there. We are going to bring um, Dosic in. And we are just going to move Sergi Sampri further forward. And Dosic's going to go in there as an anchor man, just really hold. And Sergi Sampri's going to go as an advanced playmaker on support. And we were just going to look just to hold out. Everybody that's playing the FA Cup finals come off. You get to see um, Sergi Sampri play 90 minutes as well, which is great for the club. Barring an injury right now, we've got through an unscathed. We're going to win. You would imagine as Jermampe hits it. All right, I think we're going to win, but all of a sudden... There we are. Oh, my Woolworths he gift card came in. That's great. Anyway, Janumpi hits it. All of a sudden, 3-2. We're choking a little bit here. Can we just concentrate, lads? No need of this. There we are. Oh, my days. We're going to lose, aren't we? Verano heads down. Alex Gallo up. Get it out of the way now before the FA Cup. Go to attacking. We've got 3 new up the 3-2. Free 3-3. Two, free free. In the space of 10 minutes, we've choked. It's not like Man City have choked somewhere, have they? That would make it all worse. Man City have 3-1 up. Yeah, it doesn't matter now, this game. How are we not winning? How are we conceded free to Stoke? Stoke need a fourth now to get back into it and to save themselves. Kim Jen finds Dosek into Sergi Samper, into Luozano. Luozano with the ball over to Silva, who's missed so many chances. Silva, though, he puts it wide. We've choked away the lead. Wow, what a weird way to end the season. We could actually lose here as Tyron gets the ball. Kawans Gallo hits it from distance over the bar. And there we go. You know, we have quite a rotated side. Anyhow, time's ticking away here. Look, it looks like it's going to be full time here as Dosek might hit it from distance. Find Silver. Silver back to Dosek. There we go. Stoke have done well to come back into there. Time to sell Silver. I can't. He's a wonder kid for the future. He's got plenty of time to grow. And there we go. So many chances we've missed. We've conceded three goals late doors. Look, I don't really care. The FA Cup final's there. I'm going to get aggressive and tell him that it was not good enough, I'm afraid. But there we go. Anyway, you know what that means, boys. The FA Cup final is coming up. And that is the end of the episode. If you've enjoyed episode 45, give it a 48. Give it a like. Next episode is the FA Cup final. We finished fifth. Two points behind City. We probably should have finished level points. There we are. I'm going to send the assistant to that one there. And there we go. We get 33 mil. We finish in the Euro Cup. But we've got the FA Cup coming up against, Sund um, against Sunderland, against Arsenal. You do not want to miss it. Episode 48 is done. Episode 49 is the FA Cup final. Links in the description below to come follow us on Twitch and on Twitter as well. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for watching episode 48. And I'll see you next time for episode 49 and Bright Lights.